हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू ईसी एकेडमी इन दिस लेक्चर लेट अस अंडरस्टैंड इमेज सेंसिंग एंड एक्विजिशन इन द प्रीवियस लेक्चर वी अंडरस्टूड द कंपोनेंट्स ऑफ इमेज प्रोसेसिंग सिस्टम वेयर द फर्स्ट पार्ट और द फर्स्ट स्टेप वाज टू एक्वायर एन इमेज यूजिंग ए सेंसर so here we will understand how an image is acquired using a sensor usually images are generated by combination of illumination source and the reflection or absorption of energy from that source by the elements of the scene that is being imaged so we can generate an image using illumination source as well as the reflection and absorption of energy from the source by the elements that are being imaged for example the illumination can originate from a source of electromagnetic energy such as radar infrared or x ray the illumination can also originate from the source such as ultrasound or even a computer generated illumination pattern depending upon the nature of the source the illumination energy is reflected or transmitted through the object if we say the illumination energy is reflected back for that we can take an example as light that is reflected from a planar source if we say the illumination energy is transmitted through an object for that we can take an example as x ray that is passing through the patient's body to generate a x ray film so to acquire an image we require a sensor figure a shows a single sensor here the incoming energy is transformed into the voltage by combination of input electrical power and the sensing material this sensing material will be responsive to particular type of energy that is being detected the output voltage is a response of the sensor digital quantity of this output voltage is obtained using a digitizer so output of a sensor will be in analog form this analog voltage will be converted into digital form using a digitizer so this is the principal module of image sensor which is used to transform the illumination energy into the digital image form figure b shows the line sensor where the sensor is arranged in the form of a line this line sensor is also known as linear sensor figure c shows an array of sensor where this sensor will be arranged in the form of an array now let us understand image acquisition using single sensor figure a shows a component of a single sensor where the output of this sensor will be proportional to the light as the light energy varies the output voltage will also vary example for this type of sensor is photodiode whose output is also proportional to the input light the use of filter in front of sensor increases the selectivity for example if we consider a green pass filter this green pass filter will allow only green light and the output will be stronger for the green light compared to other light that is sensed by a sensor to generate 2d image using single sensor there has to be relative displacement in x and y direction if you consider this as an example where the image is acquired using a single sensor so the displacement of the sensor should be in x direction as well as y direction this figure shows an arrangement that is used in high precision scanning where the negative film is mounted on to the drum whose mechanical rotation is provided by the displacement in one direction and the single sensor is mounted on to a lead screw that provides motion in perpendicular direction this method of image acquisition is expensive but it is slow to obtain high resolution image the mechanical digitizers which are used are known as micro densitometers now we'll see image acquisition using sensor strip line sensors 
are shown in figure B. These type of sensors are most popular and frequently used. This strip provides the image element in one direction and the motion perpendicular to the strip provides image in another direction as you can see in this figure. These type of sensors are used in most flat bedded scanners. Sensing device with more than 4000 or more inline sensors are possible. Inline sensors are usually used in airborne image applications. The image system is mounted on aircraft which flies at a constant altitude and speed over a geographical area that is to be imaged. One dimensional image sensor strips that responds to various bands of electromagnetic spectrums are mounted perpendicular to the direction of the flight. These strips gives one line image at a, a time and motion of this strip completes the other dimension of a 2D images. The sensor strips can also be mounted on a ring configuration and are used in medical or industrial imaging to obtain the cross sectional image of 3D object as you can see in this figure. X-ray is the source that provides illumination and the sensor opposite to the source clocks the energy passed through the object. Example of circular sensors can be an X-ray. Now, we will understand image acquisition using array sensor. So, figure C shows the array sensor. These type of sensors are found in digital cameras. So, usually these type of sensors will be used in digital cameras. These sensors are known as CCD array which are known as charged coupled device array. So, motion of this sensor or movement of this sensor is not required for these type of array sensors. This is about image sensing and acquisition. Hope you have understood the topic. Thank you.